When it came to the Faroe Islands, everybody knew it was just a matter of time when it would come to your village or city. One of the first things we did uh, to contain the situation uh, was to close the borders. A lot of people were thinking about the Faroes as, as a safe haven uh, in the beginning, but as time goes, huh, it's more like a trap. It seems that small societies have often very explosive epidemics. I was thinking, if 500 people would get sick in the Faroe Islands, what do we do? So we have a long tradition of, uh, of isolating people at islands or houses or, or villages. Uh. Yeah, well, I think it's in our DNA to uh, look out for each other. You know, if, if you didn't do that uh, many, many years ago, you wouldn't survive on the islands. Luckily, there was one guy at the um, National Laboratory in Torshavn. He had the instruments to take the tests, and that was fantastic. That he was so clever that he thought, it will come here, I can make the test when it comes. In other countries, they couldn't do that. <laughs>